My name is Ellie Venn. I'm a self-proclaimed revolutionary. Today, I would like to talk about doom surfing. It's a new catchphrase and has nothing to do with hanging tents, smoking weed, or planning a fantastic Halloween party. I'll tell you what it does mean though when we come back. Please hit the subscribe button and the notification bell and I'll see you back here. Surf means to scroll looking for shocking, distressing information. It's not even that you're necessarily looking for it, it's that you're disallowing all of this doom and gloom information to come into your schemata, your frame of reference, your brain throughout the day. Not a care or a consideration to where you're really getting the information. Doom scrolling is actually causing really significant problems culturally. And I'm sure you read about some of these things with some regularity because it can't be ignored that it's dangerous that anyone can put out any kind of information. Not in the way of like, we don't have our like right to speak sort of thing, but there are some people who are specifically trying to scare you. There are people who are specifically trying to freak you out. There are people who are actually feeding you misinformation so that you buy a little tchotchke on their site. So my hope for you today is that you will take a more curated approach to your scrolling, to the information that comes in. That when you look for news, you go to a source that you respect. Every time you click on some hateful negative story, the internet world says, aha, she loves doom surfing. And then the next thing you know, your whole life, you're just gonna see a bunch of them. It's kind of like when I go looking for like platform boots, that's all that shows up in my feed. As a Groovolutionary, it is super important that we fill the well with really amazing things, great information, hopeful information, empowering information, real information. And if we question the information, that we take it a step further and go ahead and seek another source before we get in an argument with a stranger over someone else's lie. So the moral is, do not be a doom surfer. Surf, if you will, but consider your sources and take a proactive approach to the information that's coming in. Ask yourself, are you looking for distractions? Are you looking for dooms-ish info? My name is Ellie Venn. I'm a self-proclaimed revolutionary. Tell me what you do to avoid doom surfing, or if you do, and eh, comment any way you will. You know, this is a groovolution. I'm open. Right.